Connecticut woman Amy Lapos is the latest to accuse former vice president and rumored 2020 hopeful Joe Biden of inappropriate contact. Amy says Biden grabbed her by the head and rubbed noses with her during a 2009 <laughs> political fundraiser. This news comes out days after former Nevada legislator Lucy Flores accused Biden of kissing her on the back of her head in 2014 when she was a candidate for lieutenant governor. I'm, what the fuck is he thinking? Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. I mean, Eskimo kisses are inappropriate now. I thought Confused. that was adorable. Adorable. Like <laughs> we're, not, we're not touching noses in 2019. We are it's not. It's adorable when like you know the not. person. When it's someone you don't know, what, true, what true, true, the true. hell is it's that? It's always cute. Except if you if you homeless and you try to touch your face to my face. <laughs> <laughs> All of this, it sounds like Joe Biden just like doesn't know how sex works. He's like, yeah, let me kiss her on the back of the head. <laughs> like, like he doesn't seem like a predator. I, I, this guy, it just seems like a really confused dude. Just yeah, seems like somebody's stepping over his boundaries. You know what I mean? Just yeah, thinking yeah. like, oh, I'm a really likable guy. Y'all all fuck with me, you know. So I'm let, let me be a little affectionate. Yeah. And let me kiss that skull, baby. She, <laughs> she said she felt uneasy when he kissed the back of her head. Like. Clap if somebody kiss you right here, you'd be uncomfortable. Clap, clap. Uh, <laughs> now, some of y'all didn't clap. Some of you guys didn't clap, but like, I don't know, like maybe she had a wig on and Man, she, what? she was afraid he felt the braids. <laughs> in the back of her head. I don't know, that's, that's why I would be uncomfortable. No, I, would you I let miss... somebody kiss you on the back of the skull? No. Right by the spinal? If I didn't know them? Yeah. That's right, okay. Here's the, here's the shit. Mm -hmm. mm. Here's the shit. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. She's going full feminazi. Okay, uh oh. She's got her blazer on. She's no. got her blazer off. Got her off. Show me. Uh oh. Okay. I'm sorry. Let's look at his statement that he released. He says, "Not once, never did I believe I acted inappropriately. Mm -hmm. If it is suggested I did so, I will listen respectfully. But it was never my intention. I just." I, oh. Sounds good to me. No? Okay. <laughs> no, Zach. All right, all right, all right. No, Zach. Okay. <laughs> now, I, I saw this statement listed as an apology. But, that's not an apology. I mean, okay. But why would he apologize if he don't really feel like he did anything wrong? Yes, well, but this is, this, this is the real tea, okay? Okay. Most men do stuff, okay, mm -hmm. that make women uncomfortable, okay? Sure. And they it's don't It's not know. necessarily problematic. Yeah. It's not... Like, we're petite. Uh -huh. People think that they can just like pick us up when they see us. They think that they can like- Like hug my us. culture just- Sometimes, yes, exactly. yeah, yeah. sometimes like I'll go, I'll, I'll go for like a handshake or a high five and people yeah. be like, come on! Oh, no. And it's like, I wasn't trying to hug you. And like, as a woman, mm -hmm. we can't always go to HR and be like, well, I wanted a high five, but he hugged me. Like, that sounds no, yeah. funny. Who mm -hmm. are you gonna but, go to? Who's Joe Biden's manager? He's yeah. the, oh, he's the vice, he was the vice president. You're gonna go his to Obama? Manager was Obama. You're gonna go to Obama yeah. and I think go, Obama oh. was his boss. You're so do you think, so for what you were saying, do you think if Joe Biden just came out and didn't have an excuse or talk about his intentions and he just said, I'm sorry, is that Well, he didn't know he did anything or? wrong. A lot of men, I feel like, have issues with when women speak out on Twitter during this like Me Too movement situation because they see these tweets that women are sharing and they're like, I've done that, mm -hmm. and that's why they get so angry because they're like, well, it wasn't problematic when I did, did it. Yeah. Yeah. And it's yeah. like, but it's because women are taught to like not rock the boat.